Hello viewers. So today uh, we are going to see how to convert the C sharp object uh, to the JSON. Okay. So here we uh, you can see that I have one variable. Uh, okay, the object uh, object. So here I have uh, one class uh, that I defined already. Class and the my date. So let let have the first name and last name and the date of birth. Okay. When he let. Uh, is uh, uh, just uh, I just uh, keep the year as well. So first name, date, uh, data, uh, data birth that will accept uh, my data uh, type. Okay, that will contain year, month, and date. So first name is uh, Markov and last name, and data birth is a new my date. So that will hold in the data birth. So how to convert uh, this uh, to the JSON is uh, today's topic. So here I going to use a JavaScript. Uh, serializer so that will come under script dot serialization okay fine so i just uh, take one more object something like json okay equal to new okay javascript serializer so, so this will be inherited okay it's uh, not uh, Add ordered in as a reference so I just go on the add first the reference it is under system dot web dot script on sec okay let me add the system dot web I think it uh, under web dot extension system dot web dot extension yeah okay so now yes uh, now my namespace got got here so okay dot JavaScript serialization dot I use serialization serialize pause the object so my object is so pg so this I going to pause here okay fine so my uh, serializer is ready now it's converted and uh, going to give me a JSON object so that I going to write in the console dot right line json okay let me go on to run my application okay so finally i got it. my first name last name and date of birth under the date of birth have a year and the month and the day whatever i mentioned it is there here so this is the way guys uh, to convert uh, the C sharp object to the JSON by using the JavaScript serialization that is uh, from the extension web dot script dot serialization that will uh, come under system dot web dot extension. So thanks for watching the video guys. If you have any queries please comment us.